What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? Let's get into the news. The first story of the day is a released official render of the Galaxy Note 9 in lilac purple. Taking a closer look at this Galaxy Note 9 in lilac purple, you can see the two cameras on the back, uh, different size lenses. Uh, on the right hand side of that you have the flash below that the fingerprint sensor samsung logo and then you have galaxy note 9 below that and then towards the bottom that is the carrier over in europe that's just branding on the phone that i believe that they'll have uh, and then you have you can see all the regular buttons you would on the side and then on the front of the phone a very traditional looking galaxy note 9 but i currently have the galaxy s9 plus in lilac purple and I like it a lot. I think it's a really beautiful color. This one is the same exact color as what I have with my phone. So if the color that I want, it, whatever doesn't happen to be in stock or I know it's not in stock or they have the ability to choose a certain color, I would not be upset if I did get that lilac purple. What about you guys? Next up, Samsung has a new wireless charging dual pad coming up most likely when the Galaxy Note 9 comes out. And looking at this pad just from the box alone, you can see the regular charging pad that you've got in the past. And then to the right of that looks like it's for a watch. But the cool thing is, if you look to the right here a little bit, you're going to see dual fast charging. Uh, so you can fast charge two devices. Now they can either be charging two phones or charging a phone and a watch and it's compatible Qi certified. So that's cool that it is able to charge uh, a phone on that little, you know, base of a uh, watch charging pad, but regardless if you have two phones or you and your wife have two, a phone each or uh, whoever has two phones or a watch and a phone, you're able to be able to uh, fully wirelessly charge on this device. And our last story of the day is about the Samsung Galaxy Watch. We have a little bit more information about this watch due to an FCC filing. First of all, they will have two watches coming out, or two sizes. One will be 46 millimeters, and that 46 millimeter watch is going to have a display of 1.3 inches, which is the same as the Gear S3 watch. Uh, the other one will be a 42 millimeter watch, and it will be having a screen of 1.2 inches. Not a huge difference, but definitely a size difference. You could call it one a guy's, one a, a female's watch. But other than that, you're looking at a watch that should have Wi-Fi and LTE. The LTE models should be compatible on all four carriers if you want to get that LTE model. And this watch should also be available the same day the Galaxy Note 9 is. Guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. New videos every single day. My question out to you guys is, if you do buy that watch, are you getting the Wi-Fi version or the LTE version? Let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you down the road. Peace.